Managing horses on limited pasture can be challenging, not to mention it can be muddy in a hurry. Consider adding a dry lot to your horse farm. A dry lot is an area that's gonna be free of vegetation with grading and improved footing. A dry lot can help you manage horses with metabolic issues, injuries, and horses that need managed turnout time. But the main reason that you want to install a dry lot is so that you can manage grazing. So it helps you implement rotational grazing on your farm and so you can uh, let your pasture rest and regrow or if you need to do maintenance on your pasture such as fertilizing and liming. It is really important that we manage our horses out on pasture so we have adequate grass um, for them to be able to graze throughout the year. So with me today, I have two horse owners that are gonna share their experiences with installing a dry lot on their farm. The reason I wanted to put a dry lot on my farm was because I had some horses that I knew would need to be on dry lot at least 12 hours a day, an EPSM horse and several insulin resistant horses. So I knew that I would have to have a dry lot for them for a continual basis. The other really good reason to have a dry lot is every now and then something happens with the pastures um, where you need to protect your pastures or protect your horses from the pastures and I wanted a safe lot to be able to put them that would have solid footing um, and keep them off grass so that I could control what was happening with them. So when it comes to setting up a dry lot I really looked at what would give me the most stability for the longest period of time. And so I chose different materials, um, different options to be able to give me that solid footing, um, even with, as you'll see from the pictures, a 2,000 pound draft running back and forth on top of this dry lot constantly. And as you can see from the pictures, the stability has held up through the years, so it's been worth every single penny of investment that I've made. We chose to inst install a dry lot here um, because we'd already experienced a lot of trouble with mud uh, at our other farm, and this was a new area. We were starting off fresh, and we decided to go with uh, what the experts recommended and put in a dry lot. The dry lot has helped us achieve our goals uh, in uh, our rotational grazing program. We are able to get the horses off of the grass when needed, say it's uh, very flush in the springtime, we can limit their access to it. Uh, we say we have a drought, you know, we're, we're able to bring them in, give them hay and water and they, you know, the pasture can be rested and also uh, the hoof health is, uh, it's an advantage to us. We see a lot less thrush. Well, I guess the uh, first year that you go out to the mud or the snow and you lose a boot and then the horses don't really care, but you want to try to get your boot back on, then you'll say, ah, I need to do something different. And it's really made a difference in our lives. Uh, encountering the weather we have when it starts to get wet and cold in the winter, fall, makes it so much easier. 